What's up guys, welcome back to the channel and today we are going to be giving Carly's rooms back because those belong on here <laughs> um, This car is normally much lower and it, has, it had coilovers in but he had to take it out to go re-road with his car because it took his dust So what we're going to be doing today is swapping the rooms back and putting my steelies back on my car and then I'm going to respray his calipers just to say thanks for letting me use these rims for the shoot. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to respray calipers. So first things first, let's jack up the car, get the wheels off and start cleaning the calipers. So now that we have the wheels off, we are going to be cleaning the calipers. So get yourself some degreaser and a cloth. Now let's clean the back drum, the rear drum. So as you guys can see, Carl already has red uh, calipers and drums. So we're going to be spraying it red again. So it's basically just a touch up coat. So we aren't going to be adding as many coats as we would have if it was a different color. So. This is a very very cheap and quick way to respray your calipers but there are other ways so you can sand down the calipers and primer them and then spray but what i'm going to be doing today is like i say a really really quick and cheap way so i'm just going to be spraying it i cleaned the calipers now i'm going to be spraying them so a quick and easy way to mask everything off um, in one go instead of using masking tape and newspaper here and there and everywhere and spending ages trying to cover everything um, I'm going to show you a quick way to cover up everything um, so what you need is a black bag so I've already cut mine so you need a black bag and then you separate the two sides and then this one's gonna be for the front and this one's gonna be for the back uh, but I'll show you guys how to cut it when I do the other side. Um, so yeah, let's get masking. So so what you want to do is you want to make sure you get the middle of the plate of the black bag, and then you make a small hole in the middle of it and then this way you basically wrap the black bag around the caliper After you have basically pushed the brake through the plastic bag and you, have, you can mask it up using masking tape, just mask any loose end so that it doesn't fall and touch the wet paint once you do start painting. For the back, uh, how we're going to do this is we only want to prevent over well we don't want any overspray anyway but the easiest way 
to do this is to let me show you to mask it like this to the body of the car and just let the plastic bag rest behind the brake drum because it's not really a spot to tape it at the bottom um, and if you do make a hole in the plastic bag it just doesn't make sense as to how or where you're going to um, mask the plastic so yeah let me show you how to mask this so once you have everything masked up and clean you are ready to spray and what we are going to be using today is rust-oleum um, VHD I think yeah VHD and red as I showed you guys the color of the calipers already now I must add that there are many other ways to do this there are many many other methods to spray your calipers and methods that give you better results but as I've said twice already, this is just a quick um, coat of paint just to liven this up a bit. Um, I do know that there is that you can take the caliper off completely from the drum, uh, from the disc, and you can spray it separately. That way, you can spray the hard to reach places better as well, and in the end, giving you better results. But now, let's start. Start with the first coat. Uh, the first coat is a very very light coat and it is just supposed to be just a few spots, just a few sprays. So now we have waited 10 minutes um, and this first coat is touched to dry or dry to touch sorry dry to touch um, so we can go ahead and apply a thicker coat uh, for the second coat This coat, because it is a thicker coat, you need to let it sit for about 15 minutes um, before applying a final coat if you want to. But looking at this, I don't think we need a, a third coat, and this might just be the final coat. But you know what? I think I'm gonna add another coat after this just to be safe. So yeah, let this one sit for 15 minutes before applying the next coat. So guys, I've decided to not add another coat because you don't want to overdo it. <laughs> Too much of a good thing is a bad thing. You don't want to overdo it. So this is how, this is the final product. This is how it came out. Um, let me show you the back. This is how the back looks. I'm happy with how it came out for just basically two coats of spray but that is because that is because it has been sprayed or it was sprayed recently um, so I basically just cleaned it up so now you just simply just tear the plastic off tear the black bag off and there you have it done I'll show you guys we got good coverage there I'm really happy with how it came out and we don't have any overspray anyway so now I'm going to <laughs> so now I'm going to put the rims back on his car put my steelies back on my car on this side and then I'm going to move on to the other side and repeat the process of spraying the calipers and yeah I I'm going to, I told to show you guys how I want to show you guys how I cut the black bag so yeah 
I was actually stupid now and I could have reused this side that I used for the back of the car because I could have just stuck it on that side um, but yeah I'll show you guys how to cut it anyways so here you have your black bag and your scissor make sure not to drop it on the car's bonnet <laughs> um, open the black bag up the black bag up nicely then you're going to take this side over here and make a small cut here you can cut it and I wonder if now this isn't gonna work you cut it and then you just drag it all the way down it doesn't need to be perfect because you guys saw how we use it. That side is done. Now you do the same on this side. There you go. The bag split open. you want to do is you just want to cut it here cut it and then there we have a piece for the front and a piece for the back so it's quite some time later uh, took a break <laughs> uh, so now we're going to repeat the process to exactly what we did on the other side um, and that is mask the calipers up so that we don't get overspray anywhere on the car uh, so what I actually did in the meantime was put my steelies back on and put Carl's wheel back on So here we have the final product, the room is back on, the drum is sprayed nicely, uh, as I'm in front, the caliper looks good, uh, just in the vlog quickly before this battery dies, so yeah, so this car is back to how it used to be, and my car is back on school shoes, so there you have it sorry for the dirty camera my hands are extremely dirty there you have it so yeah guys thank you so much for tuning in thank you so much for the support uh, don't forget to like comment and subscribe and stay tuned for more content of course do you want to say something